Another dramatic day in court during a murder trial. Today, a woman at the center of a love triangle took the stand. Local 10 News reporter Ian Margul has been covering this trial. He joins us live from Miami. This one is like a, a movie out of Hollywood, Ian. Absolutely, and today has definitely been the most explosive day of testimony so far. You said it. The woman at the middle of this love triangle taking the stand today, she told us about her relationship with her husband. She even told us a little bit more about the relationship she was having with the man who was eventually killed. Take a look here. We're taking you inside the courtroom. Her name is Jenny Marin. She took the stand first thing this morning, and she started out describing how she met Manuel Marin in 2000, but she said she didn't want to begin a full relationship with him at that point. In fact, she moved to Miami with another man, and while dating him, she met Camilo Salazar, and the two became friends, she says. But the relationship with that other man ended, and she moved back to New Jersey, where she got back in touch with Marie. They ended up moving to Miami. They got married, and after that, she rekindled her friendship with Salazar. But soon she realized that friendship was getting more serious. Did you notice that you were falling in love with him? Yes. When you noticed that you were falling in love with him, Ms. Marin, did you say to your husband, hey, I'm done with this marriage, I'm gonna go with somebody else? No. Why not? Well, I wasn't gonna go with Camilo. I, that we never discussed that. That was never our plan to be together. What you was know? your plan? We didn't have a plan. So for the most part, she has stayed pretty even keel throughout the entire testimony until just about 30 minutes ago. The prosecutor asked, do you feel responsible for this? And she said, sometimes while fighting back tears. Now they said that she is always that way, always pretty even keeled. So even getting that little bit of emotion out of her, you can really see just how much she is going through being on the stand right now. Her emotional testimony is still ongoing as we speak. We're going to make our way back inside. We will have the latest for you today on Local 10 coming up just a little bit later. For now, we are live in Miami. I'm Ian Margo, Local 10 News.